Hi everybody, welcome back to XCOM, and uh, I don't think I've ever started a mission where I've just zoomed out. It's kind of neat, so, you know, it's just a uh, shitty place to be. Oh, we're in Africa, actually, so. Uh, but I don't know why there's so much water, and I thought it was like more of like a desert. Maybe I'm wrong. I've never been to Africa, so I don't really know. Anyways, we're doing this weird mission here, so, yeah. With chrysalids and stuff, so that should be fun. So I got like... I don't know, we got stealth and a whole bunch of other folks, so we should be okay. I, I don't see a problem with this loadout. We just need the, we really need the med, med kit, and we also have the, um, or the stabby stabby melee thing, so I think that's all we really need, to be honest. I mean, we got Psy. Question is, can we take over a crystal? Because I want that to happen. Sky Ranger deep in position for deployment. I'm totally going to take over a, 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 a crystal edge, just Shannon playing you guys know that. barely managed to pull these coordinates from that codex thing they had down in the shadow chamber. We're guessing this may be its origin point, but can't know for sure. Based on the fight it put up, I'd expect heavy resistance either way. Good luck down there. Well, let's give it a try then. Target coordinates are just ahead. Move to investigate the site. Hostile presence is currently unknown, but expect the worst. I always expect Score the worst. Concealment active. All right, we have a nice chimney here for myself. Uh, why can't I see someone? Oh, because right, there are people here. Oh, we have our codex already. Commander. That codex provides the ideal opportunity to infiltrate the advent network. We will need to move in with the Skulljack to initiate the process. Kyle can technically come up here too. Affirmative, moving out. Alright, Mr. Shiv has the Skulljack, so we'll move him as close Shiv as we can. Location confirmed. Uh, let's see. That will go right here. So I guess that will be the one we're going to try and get then. This is like the most awkward situation. Okay, they're coming slightly more towards us. Alright, is, is he in range to actually just go up to someone and just codex them right now is the question. Or, sorry, why am I saying codex them like it's a verb? No, I meant, like, go and just frickin', uh, you know, I'm th I think I hear chrysalid back there. No, I hear it over here. But, you know, we can't be sure about that. And the game's just having a nap right now. Let's see what we, what we get out of this. We can't actually skull mine him yet, so... I actually can't fire my sniper at him. I'm thinking, I'm thinking we just open up with a grenade or something, but, or actually this void thing. Yeah, let's open up with this void thing. I don't want to kill this thing, but I'm hoping it'll move closer. The rift opens. The rift rope ends. Let's hope that he kind of moves closer to us or something. Or, or maybe he tries to flank us. Wow, that guy got ruptured. Why? We're visible here. What? What are you doing? Oh, he's just... He's getting like bonus attacks on literally everybody. And I don't know why. Alright, we can totally codex that guy. Totally gonna codex him. He shot his own guy, but we can't actually see him, so... Alright, alright, we got this, guys. Alright, let's see. Katarn... Not Katarn. Mr. Shiv. So we're gonna go Skull Mine... Why him? Why not a Codex? What? Oh, I think he can't see him, that's why. He needs line of sight. Why? What? Oh no, Skulljack. Oh, it's a Skulljack, sorry. Not Skull Mine, Skulljack. 
It's a big difference, apparently. All right, let's try it. The heck, you're both on the same ground? And I just stab this guy. All right, I guess we want a small cache. All right, we did it, guys. Unauthorized access to the network. Why is the little guy there? We did it. Oh, what the? Who the fuck's this? Wait, who the fuck is this? Commander, I believe we are seeing something entirely new. An alien species that has so far managed to elude capture or observation by resistance forces. I strongly advise a cautious approach. Oh, uh, you mean, you mean, ca by cautious approach, you mean grenade the everlasting shit out of him, right? Because that's, that's what I'm going to do. Uh, all right, here's what we're gonna do. Kyle's gonna move up to here. Whatever you say. Pat's gonna move up to here. Absolutely. And we're gonna just. I, I don't know what he is though. I just want to get the side of the house. That's a good there, grenade. Catch. Actually, that might remove Mr. Shiv's uh, cover. I just I wasn't checking that. Ah, he still has it. So what is he? Oh, he just moved. What? Okay, I'll just shoot him. I mean, I'm okay with that. Okay. That... Uh, I... I okay, so... That was apparently an enemy, guys. You may have not known this, but it was an enemy. We just kind of killed it, so I don't know what it does. I, I okay, so we got it. We encountered another enemy. Like it, it moves after it gets hit. It, it's like the what is it? Like a version of the Codex, or what? What's going on? Is my question. Yeah, fuck that tree. You get, you get him, Kyle. Uh, I don't think stealth needs to break out of stealth now. I mean, that guy's panicked, so I don't think he's gonna do anything. I, I, I wish I looked at him more. I didn't actually think I'd kill him that quickly, because like I saw that. What was that thing last mission? The um, uh, it wasn't. It was that dude. The uh, uh that that giant sphere, the gatekeeper, right? Like we saw hit we saw one of those things and that like that one was easy as hell. Uh let's call mine let's let's call mine this guy. This is so dangerous, but so fun. Cause I haven't used this thing nearly enough. Definitely mistakes are gonna be made. I'll say he's like lagging as he moves up. What the hell is that over there? Oh enemy intel. <laughs> what? We get nothing. We get literally nothing. Alright, well, I think... Oh god, there's a turret there. Non ce la Mr. Shiv okay. is dead. Sono they took some damage from that. Alright, I think Pat needs to head over there. Where's Pat? So, uh, if Pat goes over here... He'll only... Well, uh, he can't see it. Does he have run and gun? I know one of I think it was Adam that had run and gun. Maybe Cal should do it. Yeah. I think I okay, I think I think what we're gonna Oh yeah, this thing, fuse. Oh dude, there's a there's a guy on the ground here with a grenade. This guy has a grenade and we can detonate it. That's so awesome. Alright, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna move We're gonna move uh Ken over here. Just because I wanna make sure that guy lives. And we're gonna rocket the turret. Uh, also, if you didn't notice, I did swap uh, rockets to uh, can just because I figured that that um what's my call it? I, I think Pat has enough explosives, so I think I thought it was just I thought it'd just be better this way. I show something something. All right, uh, let's see. I want to get a shot off on that guy. Here's the thing: Kyle will not be able to do anything once he gets there.
Question is, can Kyle kill it in one hit? Because if he can't, then he might be really screwed. I don't think I should have that much faith in Kyle, to be honest. Uh, no offense to Kyle. Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to see if I can grenade it. And if we have a guaranteed grenade, then I feel safer about it. We do not have a guaranteed grenade. We have a shredder shot. No, we don't. You just may have to take a shot. Like, the, the, the Mimic Beacon was uncanned. I actually thought we'd have more of a chance than this. He's getting flanked, though, so either way, he's going to get shot. I don't know. It's a risk, but we're going to do it. I'm going. Guys, we're, we're, putting, we're putting all bets on, on him right here. We got face off, but it's not worthless here. Come on, Kyle. Come on, Kyle. Come on, Kyle. Yeah! All bets are on Kyle. I, I never doubted him for a second, guys. What the hell are these guys? Never a dull moment with XCOM. I got just like randomly the patrol was there. Alright. So much excitement this mission, guys. Come on. Just constantly. Some enemy that we have absolutely no idea what they do came at us. Uh, some other crap happened. We'll only be able to do one Fucking shot over. against this guy. Because we can only see one of them. We, oh, we have a flank on him, actually. I think stealth's just stopping in the back there. I'm probably gonna move him back, um, but also we have uh, we have like a lot of abilities here which we're not using. Like we just don't have anybody moved up. Mr. Shiv is definitely gonna move back. <laughs> I like that just the pistol through the window. Oh man, he got the he got the nice shot. All right. I mean, here's the question. We can just state now he can get flanked here actually, so we're not gonna deal with that. What I might do is I might move back here and then I'm gonna just do aid protocol myself, maybe. Yeah, cause he, he can he can covering fire himself in that in this position. Uh, I kind of would prefer not moving him to half cover, so we're gonna actually go all the way up here. Alright, let's see what happens here. We have we have we have that covering fire thing now, which is nice. Oh, and even poisoned him. Add an insult to injury with Kyle. Okay, Kyle's been definitely the MVP of this mission. Oh that handles him. See, I think, I actually think that's really str oh, whoa, oh no, because he did the Malay thing, which is actually okay, worthless. I'm like, I'm like, I'm like, he just moved for quite the flank shot. Alright. I still want to give Kyle his, uh, his level up, so let's go, let's go make this happen, guys. Kyle deserves it. Kyle, Kyle's been a really nice guy this mission. Let's move him up here. All right, we have this thing here. So we got thirty-five percent chance on that guy. I would like to weaken this guy, so let's weaken him. But he might die because of crits. Okay, good. He didn't die. So, I, you know, it's very rarely that I'll ever say good he didn't die, because I'm pretty sure like it's a, we just got guaranteed kills. Wow, Kyle, wow. Multiple targets down. Welcome, Kyle Katarn. Welcome to your future. Welcome to the future, sorry. There's like this like in, in Jedi Outcast, which is the the last real game that Kyle was in, there was this whole sound bite of uh, between him and like the main boss at the end. Overwatch. Like they had this whole they had this whole speech basically. And so back in like the 90s, I had like this um, thing downloaded. Like, so whenever I started up my computer, it was like the Jedi Outcast theme for Windows or something. 
And like every time my computer started up, it would do like the entire speech for for that like that boss fight. And then I just memorized it. And the other thing I memorized was also the um what was it called? Um the Brood War intro. When like uh what what is it? Uh, Admiral Akbar or whatever, I don't know. It's not Admiral Akbar. Uh no Admiral Something, something guy in StarCraft. I forgot it. De Gaulle, De Gaulle and Stukov were having a conversation in the in the intro cutscene, and then where am I actually trying to go now? I'm telling this this crappy story, and then I'm actually I have no idea where I'm actually trying to go. I'm assuming up here, but it's actually really not giving me a direction, which is, I guess, good, because then it's like a non-linear game. Uh, so yeah, so like it basically, yeah, I um, I memorized that too. Because of that speech, covering now. I don't know why, but that's 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 funny as I'm hell going. to me. Uh, Mr. Shiv doesn't really need healing, so he'll suck it up. Moving to Overwatch. And can possibly move up. We'll move up here. Although technically we haven't been there, I think. Yeah, that could have been really dangerous because I don't think we've actually explored that. So I memorized the De Gaulle speech. Like, come, stand here. You need to see this. Dissecting a that's dead Zerg in a lab is one thing, but unleashing them on man is another. Yeah, that, that, that one. There's supposed to be chrysalids on this map. Alright. I'm starting to think that my sniper is worthless here, so... So we're gonna just move myself right here. It's not cover, but it's like, it's whatever. Sure thing. I can handle that. Just need to make sure everybody's prepared to time. back up stealth when stealth needs it. Movement ahead. Okay, so there's definitely something up here, which is good. So that, that that's just a funny story, you know. Oh, here we go, chrysalid. There we go. Now, do we want a chrysalid bro with us? I think we do. They're on to me. What? How are they on to you? Oh, it's burrowed. Oh, wow. Scorch circuits? What? Oh, because it's an ability that she has. We just set him on fire. Okay, so stealth just broke concealment. For some reason. So they burrow and they wait for us to come near them. That's, uh, that's crap. Oh, whatever. Just deal with this guy then. They look ugly. So this is bad because I I want to use it. I like she just broke concealment for no reason. We can't actually use her to scout now because like if they're just burrowed in the ground, like then I'm screwed. All right, so I'm gonna go. I'm gonna run upon the assumption that there's actually they know we're here now, so they're probably gonna start running at us in like droves. On my way. No problem, boss. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna do the typical Mike Black Chrysler tactics of uh, to make everybody Overwatch as they run into us. I guess Stealth is still gonna be the point person because she has the armor too. That's the other thing. Finally, something under the grind. She just gonna take a hit every time? What, how do I deal with this? <laughs> I like how he just takes damage from it too. This is kind of BS. Like, what? What do I do then? I I guess that's what the the kind of the battle scanners and stuff are for. That's my assumption right now, actually. Already there. I guess I can move all the way up. No more high ground for me, because we're too far up now. I don't think she really needs healing, but I say that. How much health is she missing? Enough that I should do it. What, I just... I heal her every time she just takes a hit from these guys? Oh, wait, you know, I just have an idea of how to deal with this. I can overwatch people as she moves up. That's actually, I think, the way we're supposed to deal with it, now that I think about it. 
Sorry, it, t it just took me a second because I wasn't sure. On Overwatch. Got it covered. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. Our two snipers. This is really bad because it's like, what if something that isn't a uh, chrysalid gets, gets triggered? This looks like... What the hell is this place, anyways? Let's move already! Oh, it's a... I'm not sure what we were expecting to find out here, but this definitely... How did they rip the codex used when it appeared? This thing could lead anywhere. It may not even be pointing at Earth. As with most things, we'll likely need to bring it back to the ship for further examination. Great, so I just overwatched my two strongest people to deal with... Not this guy, essentially. Alright, we're gonna, I think, move back here. Because I'm freaking out now. Actually, we can, we can put her into concealment again. Tired of waiting around. Where is that canned? Canned will have to use the meme beacon. And then I'm going to move him into cover. Actually, no, he just ended his turn. I should have done that first. Oh, well. Shoulda, woulda, coulda. Nessun problema. Affirmativo. So, let's let him run into us. Oh, chrysalids, nice. A lot of chrysalids, nice. A lot of chrysalids. <laughs> oh my god. I would I wouldn't give for a kill zone right now. Executed. Nice. That, that's the second time that's ever proc. <laughs> we poisoned him? Oh I guess he's he's organic. Actually, yeah, I said that last time. I wanted to actually see what he was. He's gonna use his little cannon there. All right. He missed though, but yeah, okay. So let's let's see. What can I mind control him? Uh, let's see. Insanity domination. Yeah, it's a domination. Forty-six percent chance. I, you know, I I gotta do it. I gotta do it, guys. I, I probably should have moved into the better cover, actually, now that I think about it. Ah, uh, if domination failed. Alright, well, now we're gonna just kill him. That's a shame. Alright, we start off with, uh, Pat. Pat's gonna open up with a grenade, and then he's gonna rupture. What? Friendly fire to what? Take this. What? What's the friendly fire to? Okay, it takes off two of his armor. Or does it? it? I don't see it actually updating. It didn't actually update. Yeah, what the heck? Okay, whatever. Spray and pray. Yeah, that's a shame. We missed our rupture opportunity here. Uh, this could be bad actually now, because like that was I was kind of betting upon that, doing a lot of damage to him. But actually, now I think about it. We can shoot him twice with stealth. Finally. Why are chances so low? Oh, that worked. Thank goodness stealth is a competent shotgunner. That armor's tough. You still have another shot. There you go. Good thing I told her. She, she wouldn't know otherwise. All right. So what do we have now? We have Mr. Shiv. We got aid protocol, so we're gonna do aid protocol on uh, on stealth. What are we supposed to do? Uh, we're just supposed to neutralize all the things defending the gate. All right, we got threat assessment now. We will now Overwatch with him. Where's myself? All right, we're gonna reload and then we're gonna kill zone. It's a free reload, so we, then we can kill zone. Cause there's a lot of chrysalids there. 
No targets available though, but that's fine. Oh, we can move her back actually. Oh wait, she doesn't even have Let's ammo do in her gun. So that thing was worthless. Uh, I could've used that on someone else that was like more worthwhile. Scanning. Watch your step here. Oh look, more chrysalids. That's not good. Well, this is this is the time for kill zone to actually do something. Uh, they have dodged the. Uh, we could be in real trouble right now. Thank goodness for kills on snipers. That's all I have to say. Or wait, no, I didn't even do anything. You know that was good. That wasn't even me. It's something. It's something must be blocking my line of sight. Okay, now I'm shooting. It's that rock there. Okay, uh, maybe not thank goodness for killzone snipers. Uh, looks like they can't do anything like, like major in this one turn though. Okay, well if you're aiming over there myself, maybe I should give myself the tracer rounds. Alright. Well, uh, we got three shots and kill we got face off. Let's do let's start with uh, this thing though. Dude, this is like the best chrysalid thing ever. What's this debuff here though? Is it here is Kyle Katar and Chrysalid Hunter. Armor still holding. We we actually have a lot of things to deal with these guys, so I'm not overly worried about this. His Kand is still there. Kand hasn't used anything yet. And face off. He's too damaged again. Alright. Kand is kind of our guaranteed damage dealer, so we're gonna make sure he's okay. Okay, reload. Shotgun. Ready to engage. He's very happy with herself. Tired of waiting around. Uh, Pat has to reload. Technically, I have a shot too. I don't need to level though. Reloading. Mr. Ship can use a level though. Even though he's our healer, I think we're fine for one round. At this point, I'm just trying to give kills to people who actually need promotions, you know. Uh, we're gonna just overwatch again. So, seeing as this objective hasn't actually disappeared yet, I'm running on the assumption that something else is about to happen. We're gonna put him into high cover. Oh, he's got chrysalid poison on him. I've, I've actually never not healed someone right away. Oh, this is great. Oh, they're just burrowing there. Bunch of jerks. I, I really actually want to move my sniper up there because that's that that's a horrible position though. Uh, it looks like we're okay for the time being. I'm on it. How could turn could definitely well he gets a free reload so. Covering now. He's got well he does does he not have oh no no of course he doesn't have long watch I didn't give that to him. Overwatch. If you say so. I really want to mind control. I'm in. What the heck is the deal with this? All right. Uh, long watch. Overwatch. Uh, who else can overwatch? We're gonna move Mr. Shiv up, and then he's just gonna overwatch over here. Oops, I didn't, that wasn't a sprint, was it? That wasn't. Okay, we're gonna just sprint up here then. Okay. Kyle Katarn will come up here. Double time. 
But basically, we just gotta overwatch into these guys. Like, the weird kind of overwatching, where we gotta overwatch prior to doing anything. You guys are pretty creepy, though. Alright, do I have my uh, kill zone now? Yes, I do. I'm gonna kill zone this, and we're gonna move her up there. I'm on it. Uh, who else do we want? Okay, Ken doesn't need to do anything here. Okay, just Finally. move up here. Right. This is super dangerous, what I'm gonna do right now. Here I come! Here they come. Just like it's like someone has to be the bait while we shoot them. Does no one else get a shot? I think Kyle was supposed to have it, but not close enough. Oh, we just killed him like that. Okay, we got to move everybody up to potentially back this person up, though. Got it, moving. Uh, we're gonna do a protocol on her. Because I want her to get an Overwatch shot. I like how she got the buff too. I think I might have to make her. Uh, I may have to heal her. But now, like, we're gonna wait on the heal actually, because that's our last heal. Are you just gonna stand there? Already there. This is our last person. Because she could die to chrysalid poison. Covering. Yeah, here we go. This is what I mean. I still have kills on up, but it was it's just not enough. Does no one else have any overwatch? Does she not have the thing where she's supposed to they don't trigger overwatch, do they? Alright. How long does that chrysalid poison last for? Is the question I ask. I I've never quite had to deal with uh, chrysalids like this. I want to mind control him. Ninety-six percent. Don't fight. Let it happen. Because at least maybe he'll like take a hit for us, you know. I think at this point, like we're done. Domination. Ninety-six percent. Domination failed. Nice. I'll get him next. Yeah, one job. Hopefully, this is the last one, anyways. Judging by the achievement I just got, I think it is the last one. You can't handle it's kind of a spoiler me. thing. <laughs> Status confirmed. All hostile contacts in the AO have been eliminated. The gateway is secure. Status confirmed. Commander, we've secured the psionic gateway, and recovery teams are en route to the site. Now it's up to Tigan and Shen to figure out what this thing does. Okay, so a lesson learned, chrysalids suck. Operation Wolf Dance. Poor Stealth. Stealth had to do, be in the middle of that. We should have had Witchel in the middle of that. It, thank goodness, though, we had that nice armor on her that basically, uh, like, returned some damage. That was actually pretty nice. I, I'm actually thinking about the game, the health regeneration one, but then again, yeah. Because that would that would counteract the Chrysalid Poison. Now that, now that armor doesn't seem so incredibly bad now that I think about it. Because that, that was weird. I, like, I almost would say this is maybe, like... What dare I say, like when there's a lot of chrysalids, maybe to have a, a guy that's good at blade master, you know, just to lay everyone that comes close to him instead of dealing with concealment, you know. Now, I know what I'm saying is literally heresy, but I think it's the only time I've ever thought to myself, maybe that was more worthwhile to do it the other way around. Stealth didn't work out that well here. Well, Katarn, Katarn finally got fanfire. Uh, it's, uh, he just fires. Three times at the same target. That's essentially what that does. That will be really nice though when it stacks with things like um, uh, the rupture and stuff like that. It's gonna be super good. All right, here we go. We can either do guardian or ever vigilant. I I don't know. I think guardian again, just because yeah. I, I actually don't know what to do with this guy. Actually, maybe we'll do ever vigilant. 
just, just you know, because I've had situations where I've ran him into situation, like I sprinted him to, like to get meld or something. So maybe him having Overwatch in that situation would be good. Although I firmly believe the specimen we have recovered is crucial to the aliens' efforts, we currently do not have the means of properly studying it. The distinctive alien artifact we recovered from the field resembles a portal or a gateway of some kind. Although we believe it provides the aliens with a means of long-distance travel, potentially beyond the confines of our world itself, it will take time before we can truly understand the gateway's function. That was an avatar. So that, that's what the avatar project is. Okay. New objective added. Examine the recovered avatar corpse. Based on what your team witnessed in the field, Commander, it is clear this psionic gateway provides the aliens with some means of far-off travel. It will be up to you to determine not only how it functions, but exactly where this gateway leads. New objective added. Alright. Complete the psionic gate shadow project. Commander, if you come across anyone with an aptitude for the sciences, send them my way. I could use the help. In order to analyze the alien psionic gateway we recovered, we will need to make the appropriate modifications to the shadow chamber first, Commander. <laughs> well, it requires no it requires no no power. Shadow chamber upgraded. How long will this take? Avatar autopsy. Uh, so we need to do the psionic gate then. I'm not gonna do that now because like this thing is almost done right here. How much supplies do we have? We have a ton of supplies. All right. Well, uh, I think we're mainly short on intel right now. So. Did we set this back? This unusual artifact could be crucial to uncovering the aliens' true intentions, Commander. I commend you on your efforts. I like how I did it twice. I just I, I like I just did it like tw like two things in one mission. That's great. Uh, let's see. East Africa. I guess we'll make contact here. Yeah, might as well. Setting course for the East African sector. How much more power do I have? I have a lot of power left or whatever. All right. Attempting to establish local regional contact. Well. We didn't get much uh, here to do, so heavy mech codex. There's a gatekeeper again, Archon. So gatekeeper is not a machine because I was able to take it over. So I guess it's an organic thing, which is interesting. Setting course for Chile. I love Chile. We didn't. We didn't even get to really do anything here. It's just like, oh, here's your next mission, asshole. I'm like, oh, okay. I'm sad. Oh, uh, what do we got? Well, we got, I think, basically everybody, except for Stealth is out. That's that's for Jack to come along. Finally, we get to use Jack. Finally! The thing you guys all wanted, more Witchel. We can never get enough Witchel, guys. And that's it for today, guys, and remember, we will be watching.